here is the maxwell inductance switch this is used for the find the unknown inductance here the sine wave input source here is sine wave connection dotted line we have to connect it detector that is for the unknown and here is the standard 10 milli henry r4 represent this and r3 is represented by this this is digital null detector now you have to patch the instruments here as per the procedure manual x8 to x9 x5 to x6 everything is given in the procedure there is the formulation now as per the manual connect here b2 to b4 x8 to x9 all the dotted lines have some connections so you have to make it according to the unknown that is for the accord unknown inductance here we have standard inductance l1 value 10 milli henry here is the detector value detector connection now all the connection is completed now you have to balance the bridge for the resonance point or the minimum point with the help of R3 and R4. Here is the unknown inductance value. These are the unknown inductance. These are the sum observation table. Here standard value resistance R3, resistance R4 and that is calculated and actual value. Now switch on the instrument. Set R3 to any value. Suppose it is 100. Now change the R4 to make it minimize the resonance. Here wait for some time because AC signal. Here is the least. Then again increase. So that this is the resonance point. Now if we increase this value it will automatically unbalance increase this value unbalance lower value then lower down then again increase so that we have this resonance value then value is this 1 into 100 100 that is 0 we have to adding is that means 100 ohm and for the r4 it is 0 1000 and it represent 2 2000 then R4 is 2000. When we put the formula R4 and R3 value, R3 and R value, the calculated value is 0 0.50 millihenry and actually 0.5 millihenry. Same. So that we can use another unknown inductance or you can choose your another uh, from outside to find the inductance value and that is instrument give the value of unknown inductance, hence demonstration is complete. Done.